All right, guys, so hopefully this is going to be the last time I have to make a video for 11-23 as well as 11-27. I am back on the same account that I made the previous video about 11-27 with the low level. A lot of people are still coming up to me asking, even complaining about my videos saying, oh, you use, you know, all maxed out promotion, whatever cookies in the video. This doesn't help. What the heck? And quote unquote, bad words, bad words, insert, whatever you guys want to do. But you know, the tips that I give you doesn't change as long as you have decent toppings on the cookies and use the cookies that I suggest. Then even with the low level treasure, even with the low level cookies, you know, even with toppings that are not the best that even I share, you can still beat these stages, guys. The stages now, 1123, 1127 are not hard compared to some of the stages that are out. Like, you know, episode 13, episode 14 are the harder ones. If you're stuck here, then there are a couple problems that you want to try to see for your account. Maybe you haven't invested in the treasures that I suggested you guys in previous videos that I have up on my channel. Maybe you're not using the cookies that I've suggested. You're not taking the tips that I've suggested. Then, you know, of course, you're not going to be able to beat some of these stages because your cookies are not fit to beat these stages, right? The only thing that I would suggest, if you guys do not have Sea Fairy, then use someone like, you know, you can use probably Dark Cow. You can probably use uh, someone like Clotted Cream. I know I've done it. With this account with clotted cream so i know clotted cream works uh, you probably could use a vampire here too but on this account vampire is a bit of a lower level so i don't really suggest using vampire if it's too low level and yeah i mean pretty much you know these cookies that you guys have i mean pretty much like clotted i'm sure a lot of people can pull clotted at the end of the event so hopefully you can use clotted instead of sea fairy but let me show you guys exactly what i mean here okay uh, these stages are not hard, especially with the new buffs and technologies out there now, guys. Like, these stages should not be the problem, especially if you guys are taking the advice that I give on my videos. Like, I don't make the videos to just show off, you know? I'm making the videos, at least these guide videos, so it helps you. You know, those gotcha videos, whatever those videos are, you know, have to show you guys and entertain you guys. But these videos that I made guide for, it's not to just waste your time like i don't understand it's not it's not just there to you know waste people's time like of course it's not going to be exactly the same of you know how i have it but you know it's still going to be pretty similar so the only thing here that i suggest because we do have the feather is i would definitely suggest you guys wait on using strawberry crepe skill uh right before wizard cookie uses his skill so i'm going to use it right here and then wizard is probably going to use his skill soon i will have the damage resist buff on my cookies right now and then you know i won't die and even if strawberry crepe does die the feather will make them come back and boom now i'll be able to clear the stage so it's not that hard I and for anybody who does not have sea fairy or and, you know like you guys will say oh i don't have sea fairy what do i do uh, then you can use something like this, you know, some use double tank where you use dark cacao and you use strawberry crepe. Someone who does not have dark cacao, you can use wallberry. Wallberry is another great, uh, you know, cookie to use because of the 15% damage resist buff that, you know, you passively get. This account does not have wallberry leveled up, so that's why I'm using dark cacao here. I don't use frost queen. Frost queen is going to be useless in this stage just because those two cookies are not going to get frozen, uh, you know it's not that hard guys i'll just show you here too this one right here it's uh you know these stages nowadays like these are really old stages you know i made videos on these literally like nine months ago like seven months ago uh you know with the introduction of new cookies it's gotten so much easier than it was before like you know when there was no dark cacao when there was no wallberry when there was no eclair it was extremely hard you know but now with all these cookies added it's like it's probably a lot easier than you know nine months ago when it was seven months ago you know, when these stages were actually hard with the cookies that you had you know so i would say take the advice use the strategies you know so here we go i'm just gonna save strawberry crepes uh skill here just for the uh you know damage resist buff so when wizard does use his skill i'm just gonna use it right here so that you know sorbet and eclair takes the 50 percent you know damage resist buff so that they don't die it's pretty easy now these stages like you know these cookies are just doing so much damage of course like i said the eclair may be five star promotion but 
you know, I'm sure a lot of you guys have already invested in Eclair and it's probably higher than level 47. So if it's higher level than 47 and you guys are on this stage with a lower promotion Eclair, it will not make a significant difference, guys. It, it may make a bit of a damage difference, but, you know, it won't it won't kill you, you know, so like I said, this stage is not that hard. I would suggest you use Strawberry Crepe to give that damage resist buff to two of your cookies so that they don't die and can actually tank a wizard's damage from his skill. You do need damage resist on your cookies though, guys. If you have no damage resist on your cookies, then they're gonna die off. And that's something that I always suggest you guys have damage resist on your cookies, even if it's a little bit, okay? So please take the advice, listen to the videos, actually, actually watch it my actual retention rate on these videos are like two minutes when the video is at least like seven minutes obviously you guys are skipping the important part so please watch it you know don't just look at what is in front of you and be like oh this guy has all five star promotion maxed out cookies this is not gonna help this is bs this is whatever no just take out take all of that out just listen Take the advice and then try it out. Look at the toppings. Look at the treasure level. Look at your cookie level. Look at how you guys are playing the game. Look at the skills you guys are using. And then, you know, comment down so that I can help you. There's so many things I want to say, but I'm just going to end it here, guys. If you guys have questions, please leave it please leave it down in the comments below or try to ping me on discord try to message me on discord I'll, I'll try to help out as many people as possible but you guys gotta realize i'm studying to be a doctor i don't have all the time in the world to help everyone out um that's why i make these videos so i can help majority of the players uh, through these videos but hope you guys found it helpful hope you guys can beat these stages and i will continue to make videos uh now tackling probably some of episode of 13 as well as 14 using some of these lower accounts uh from the viewers anyways guys thanks for watching once again and i'll see you guys all on the next one